Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Hey, I'm so excited. We had a grand opening of a Dollar Tree. I'm a total geek nation for sure. I, um, well actually my husband and I were driving by a plaza that we live by and um, I saw a Dollar Tree and I was like, there's a Dollar Tree. So we got out of the car with the baby and everything and it was all cold and then I see one day till the grand opening. So I was like, oh my gosh, seriously? So I looked inside, I'm like, it's all stocked up. So the next day, my sister and my mom and I, we do like kind of, well, we're starting to do like a weekly lunch type of deal. I told them Dollar Tree, there's a grand opening. So we all went and I took a picture with the Dollar Tree guy. Check it out. You don't mind me looking all like, all haggardy. It's cause you know, I got up early, I have a baby and, um, which he's here by the way. So if you hear, let me see if you can see him. Let me move my bag. There he is. Whoops. Let's see. Can you see him? There he is. Say hi, Tristan. <laughs> so, yeah, he's here with me. So, if you hear some crunching, he's learning to play with his teething toys now. So, that's what he's doing. So, I'm going to show you guys what I got because they had some items at this Dollar Tree that I haven't seen at the ones near my house. So, I'm ready to share these. So, here we go. Okay, so I'm telling you, my mom, my sister, and I were running around like lunatics, and the first thing that my sister and I spotted were these Sure Fresh reusable cupcake containers. These were really cute um, and very convenient for this time of year. A lot of people like to make cupcakes for Valentine's Day, so these were in the Valentine area, so these are seasonal, so definitely if you guys find these, get your hands on them, because it has a handle, so very very convenient and you know taking cupcakes to places is always difficult so and there's always containers like this that I see but they're expensive so for a dollar I mean you can get like two or three of these and you're good to go so that was the first item um, we found a lot of different um, cleaning items as well which I'll show you right now these I've seen a few of you guys from the Dollar Tree community here on YouTube haul these and I hadn't seen these these are little owl piggy banks and it came in silver gold and red my mom actually really wanted the red and she went back and got them because she just couldn't stop thinking about them. I'm like, go and get them because you're going to wish you had them later. So I think these just look really classy. They look like something you would find like at Pure One. In person, they come off a little more expensive looking than they do on camera. But I think I'm going to leave this one in here in the guest room because you can see behind me I have gold. And then I'm probably going to stick this in our living room somewhere because we have silver. So these are really cute. I wish I would have gotten like a pair of each, but... I just, I wasn't really sure what I was going to do with them, to be honest. Um, I also got these. These are antibacterial wet wipes for hands, ideal for traveling, moisturizing, thick and soft cloths. These have vitamin E and aloe, and it's a 75 count. I figured that we could keep these in our car since sometimes I do have to change the baby's diaper on the run, and these are just something that I can just, you know, pull out and clean my hands with, although I do have sanitizer in our bag. But still, this is good for messes or, you know, if we are handling money and then we have to touch the baby, you know, there's things like that. And then my sister came across these. Um, these are the Good and Clean Disinfectant Wipes. Um, me, her, and my mom all got these. These are the uh, Fresh Scent, which smell pretty good. Um, pretty decent. I like to use these kind of wipes for the toilet. I like to wipe down the rim of the toilet and um, the handle and all that stuff. So that's what I use these for so I don't have to use a washcloth. Um, I also got D batteries because my son's swing requires batteries. Oh, and we go through them not totally like crazy. I have to say that that swing is pretty good, but I do wish it had um, a cord to it. But, um, yeah, so I'm going to give these a try. I know that they're not going to obviously last as long as most batteries do, but this says that it's ideal for low-drain devices, so we will see how this works. I'll let you guys know if you're interested. So let me see. I have two other bags over here. Okay, so I picked up some Easter items because, believe it or not, they already had a bunch of Easter stuff out. They also had a bunch of St. Patrick's Day things out and a lot of Valentine's stuff. So if you guys are wanting to get some nice things for Easter or St. Patty's Day, I recommend going now. Um, I got this garland because, I don't know if you guys remember, in my uh, Christmas home tour decor, or decor, oh my god, I can't even talk, my Christmas home decor tour, I had a little slender tree that my mother-in-law gave me by my sewing machine, by my front door. I decided to keep that up year-round because I love the way it looks there. So I'm just going to kind of decorate it with the holidays. So I got this. It has like little eggs all over it that I'm going to drape around the tree. And then I also got this bunny, which is super cute, and it's got like a little, um, hi, it's got like a little um, thing, you know, so you can hang it, and I put it on the tree, and it'll look cute kind of as a topper with the garland going down, and then I have my Scentsy uh, 
my little egg, my Easter egg warmer. So it's going to look really cute by that. And if you guys are wondering, I know a lot of people like the more classic look for different things. I'm going with the more fun and colorful things for now because my son is little. And as he gets older, I want him to kind of see that kind of stuff. When my kids get older, because I am planning to maybe have another one, I'll go for the more classic look. But for now, I just think this kind of stuff is fun for him to look at. And my stepdaughters are 13, so I think it's really cool. They liked the house for Christmas. So I also found these eggs that I can just kind of put somewhere around the house and make it look cute and these also have the little hooks on them so um, I'll probably place it in the usual areas where I put my decor so I thought that that stuff was really cute and um, I also found some other items here that were really pretty these are whoopsie I'm dropping everything these are some pictures that I found and I don't know if you guys have seen these at your Dollar Trees but they're awesome they're really glittery sparkly pictures it's not coming off as sparkly on camera as it is in person but I got this one to put out for Valentine's Day it's just super glittery it says love with two little lovebirds so I thought this would be cute for this time of year and then I got this one to put out for Easter it's also a glittery one that says life is beautiful and I thought that it just kind of went with you know the colors of this stuff and I could just place it somewhere and it'll look really cute so um, definitely keep your eyes peeled because they had a bunch of them that said like home sweet home um, really cute ones that you could use for like a little girl's room just really sparkly and trendy looking um, I also got these diaper disposable bags these are scented and they have tie clothes handles and it says perfect for home or travel I have some Arm & Hammer ones on my diaper bag right now but I figured these are great in case I run out or in case um, Tristan is with the sitter and you know you don't want to um, throw dirty diapers in somebody else's trash can so I figured that this is a great way to dispose of those if I run out of my Arm & Hammer ones and then I also got some of the little bags for the trash can these are just ones that smell like vanilla I use these for my restrooms and I'm gonna tell you that this thing lasts forever I think I had my last trash bag roll for like I'm not even gonna lie I think like four or five years and it just barely ran out so um, oh, actually this one only has 28 bags, so this might not last as long. The other one I think had like a hundred bags, so all of a sudden my nose is getting clogged. Um, I got more batteries for the swing. And then the last thing that I found that I thought was really interesting is the Salon Selective's 3 Minute Hair Therapy. This has Argon Oil from Morocco. And I used to love Salon Selectives back in the day. It looks like this. And I even have some in my stash, in my stockpile from the Dollar Tree because the scent is so good. And the shampoo really cleans your hair really nicely. Oh, this smells really good and it looks really nice and thick. So I have high hopes for this. I'll let you guys know if you guys are interested in getting a review on this. Let me know and I'll do a single one probably over on my beauty channel. So if you guys want to subscribe over there, if I find things from the Dollar Tree that are beauty related, they'll be reviewed over there. So, oh my gosh, it smells super good though. Definitely, you should pick it up. They had different formulas, I believe. This one just says intense conditioning treatment restores and strengthens. So, can't go wrong for a dollar. But that is the stuff that we got from the new Dollar Tree. If you guys have picked up some items, let me know what you got down below or anything that you've loved lately from there. I always love going to the Dollar Tree and I try to only get things that I need um, or in try to not get so many things to try, I guess, because I don't want to have like, you know, I don't want to be a hoarder, but these are all things that I'm going to use, right? So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye from me and Tristan, and we will see you guys in our next video. Bye.